Vintage Trans Party, 1960s. Maison Laurent, 198 Rue Vaugirard, Paris. So the saying goes, there's no need to reinvent the wheel. This is a reference to the unrivaled importance of the invention in 3500 BC. Prior to this, humans were extremely limited when it came to transporting things over long distances. Inventing the wheel itself wasn't the tricky part, the wheel and axle concept was the real genius, which connected the rolling cylinder to a non-moving platform. Fun to see a real, non-posed, photo, catching the mood of a dinner party, see 1860. Roman Polanski and Francoise Dorlik during filming of Cul-de-sac, 1966. This shot is an image of New York City from the early 1900s. The first thing that strikes you are how out of place the people look when compared to the buildings, but that's probably just because the buildings are still around while the style has changed quite a bit since then. Most of the people are pretty dressed up, but you can see one man in overalls on the left side of the frame. Girl looks on at British soldier in Ireland. January, 1972. Paul Newman boating in Venice during a film festival, 1963. This photo of San Francisco in 1964 is a bit mind-boggling. The city is known for its steep inclines, but this photo just takes it to a whole other level. After this photo was taken, people actually began comparing it to scenes from the movie, Inception, in which cityscapes actually bend and twist. However, this photo is very much the real deal, and it shows a pretty famous street in the city. Smoking a cigarette while riding the Tour de France, 1920s. This photo kind of shows the city's halfway point before Los Angeles was as developed as it is today, but when it was already a site of glamour and style. It shows women going shopping in the city in the early 1960s. The clothing the women are wearing could easily be worn today and not look out of place. Fashion really is cyclical. The Beatles at the EMI Studios in Abbey Road, 1967. One Cigarette, Two Lights, Photo by John Rawlings, April 1950. March 16, 1966, Neil Armstrong, Wright, and David Scott boarding the Gemini 8 spacecraft. 